guys, welcome back to another TV and Blu-ray announcement. Um, but yeah, guys, um, now I've been making a lot of videos about, uh, about that much Blu-ray. So, um, anyway. Now, yes, now this is for July Blu-ray and DVD. And digital like download like you put it like code on your phone or watch the movie on the phone. Well, um, no, yes, July second will be movie volume six. And also, oh, that day I might think about starting day this though. And yes, it po it got posted on Twitter about I want to say yesterday or last night that the um. It says, yes guys, you already know about this. The Sam is coming out on digital it's coming out on digital on July 2nd and the Blu-ray comes out on July 16th. Now I don't know much about the Sam yet. I haven't seen the movie yet. I heard that people say it was pretty good, so already guys next theme about the name. Okay guys, what's really weird is that today press started telling me to just literally follow me like this morning. So far back. Right, next theme. And really good out of me is also that we saw the uh, the model of what our Mac looks like and what will happen at eleven. And this is what he looks like before he falls to his death on the the crypt the crypt on the crypt at eleven. So yeah, guys, this is supposed to be like I know what all the others say. This is supposed to be a little crypt at eleven episode. Why well, is this feel about Ruby and the Sam? Well, I'm just trying to like get up the good things though to be, like make this video like better though. Like I said yesterday, guys. Uh, the Sam was announced to be on Blu-ray on the 16th of July, and July 2nd will be the digital downloading, which is going to be the exact same day that Ruby comes out on Blu-ray and DVD, which honestly people will be like, oh, why did the Twitter, uh, the Twitter account of the Sam announce of the Blu-ray, which the movie just came out in theaters last month, back on April 5th. Which it was like a long time ago. Also, just a month ago. But next thing, guys. Okay, guys. Now, what I want this for though. Okay. If you guys remember about a few weeks ago, we actually made a video about this pop file though. The Maya the Siren E3 2019 exclusive pop file. Now, I'm always confused about this one just for a bit. Okay. Now, I don't know if it's, it's going to be like a exclusive to any store, like it's just like, not a Switch store, like GameStop or anything. I mean, honestly, though, no, like when I went to my local Walmart, I went, I went to the movie section to check out the pop file show, and all they had was like nothing there. Like, all they had was like a whole bunch of Fortnite pop files. I think a few maybe Rick and Morty ones. And I think they even had a one like exclusive Dark Phoenix that they were talking about for the upcoming movie. But next scene. And also really the other thing about Mortal Kombat 11 is when people said it at ass, though like like the one from for a DLC for uh Combat Pack 1 or Combat Pack 1 I think. People thought it was Ash Ketchum from Pokemon. No, it was not. It was supposed to be Ash Williams from the Evil Dead. But, too bad so sad, guys. We will not go to see him in the game. Because of this little tweet that he did, which I might say I might show you, though, if I don't. And this video gets taken down for copywriting. Let's just see what he says. Okay, guys. 
here it is. It says one win, Bruce Campbell. Game over, Anthony Raymer. Bruce Campbell wins the Dowdy Hall's victory. Aaron and Raymer. The ads, the DLC, and we're looking at 11. According to Bruce Campbell himself, Il Rodez ads will not be appearing in Cup at 11. He posted this tweet about like two weeks ago. And people was like, what the hell? Is this really real or fake? Because when people said that this story happened like just this, uh, this past Monday or Thursday, that we will not going to see him in the game because he dropped out so, because of this stupid little tweet that Bruce Campbell made about, uh, about Ash would not be appearing in World Cup at 11. So, I mean, who would, I know, like, we're going to see, like, the Terminator. And yes, guys, I know we are going to actually, did I see the Terminator Dark Fate trailer? Yes, I did. It was awesome. Might want to see it. So, which, all I know, I actually remember that he was, Literally a DLC to one game, and that was like WWE 2K16. No, yes, guys, don't forget this weekend we're going to see what uh, what we'll be showing for the combat pack, the combat pack thing for World Cup 11. Like it doesn't matter, like. If it's a DLC character, or maybe staying some gameplay. We just gotta wait and see. Well, anyway, guys, hope you guys like, comment, subscribe.